Okay, Valley of Lycan. Protectorate of Ellen. Rumen is a disgrace to the Dark Elves. Huh? What do you mean? She serves the half vampires so eagerly. Don't concern yourself with politics, Demetria. I wasn't talking to you, Asquite. <laughs> Shut up, sir. We're almost there. Keep quiet. Bite me. That's just an expression. Just like, just see what I mean with these characters, like. We know there's an enemy base near Lycanvale. We're going to mess around with them a little. So none of them like each other. Like none of them are friends, and all they do is call each other bitches and stupid and shit. Where exactly? Somewhere northwest, but we haven't pinpointed the exact location. No big tactics. Just a little fire from the south would be enough to shake them up. Oh, we get calf cavalry. Level 11, too. Not bad. I might uh, usually go Orc Cavalry, but I might keep the, the Dark Elf one. Maybe just to fit the theme. They're so less effective. This is the place. But Are you sure still we have useful. Manpower for this, Lucy? We don't need more manpower when we're here, dumbass. And don't need you again. Don't. Look, human scouts ahead. We have one chance to get them. Cavalry, why don't you go say hello? They won't know what hit them. Let's go! This looks oddly familiar. I'm here. Oh, I'm it's the only time you'll ever see scouts. Same thing with Gerald's campaign in that one mission. Engage Lucy, then I'll uh, we can go cheap. But if they go for my archers, then that's gonna be a little cheap. Which it looks like they are. Shit. Yeah, yeah I'm smarter than I remember. Only level one archers. I'm not too, or level one infantry. I'm fighting against. I'm not too worried about. Come on, fucking trees get in the way. Two soldiers. Back. I don't think there's any squad leaders in this one. Not that I found. All right, let's swap them out. They, I might keep them Dark Elf Cavalry because they can hit and run with Trees of Healing, which is pretty decent. Might even get some Cavalry Archers too. I, know, I don't usually make them because I don't like microing them so much. Um, and I honestly don't even know if they're that good. Like, I'm sure they're fine. I know they're weaker than a, just a squad of basic foot archers because they don't have as many models or uh, units per squad. But I don't know their damages and stuff, whether or not they're worth it. But let's see, together. Oh, I also discovered today, very sad news, that Kingdom Under Fire 2 has officially died. Nay, not died, murdered by the company that made this game, Blue Side. I feel like their leadership, I don't know the behind the scenes stuff, I'm sure there was other issues, but it feel, I feel like whoever was making the, the decisions over there was not doing a good job. 
or had the wrong he had the wrong uh, idea of what this game should be because the sequel originally was going to be just a proper sequel uh, pretty basic you know campaign maybe some versus multiplayer that was 2006 and then it turned into a and it was for Xbox PlayStation and PC and then it just went to just PlayStation and PC uh, turned into an MMO and then became yeah PC and PlayStation still and then it became a free to play MMO and then it became a uh, an alpha and then what came out as an alpha seemed to do okay and then a beta a closed beta came out but they only allowed the beta to be played in Malaysia or Southeast Asia and Russia of all countries Especially when this is like a European-style fantasy game, um, I would t probably wager a guess that. Eight out of ten points is what I score your work. I wager a guess that. Uh, I actually wants me to regenerate. I wager a guess that British, a British crowd, maybe a French, German would be interested in some Lord of the Ringsy fantasy. Americans and Canadians definitely fucking would be. I know a lot of there's other fans of this game that I know of that I know personally so that would, would totally weird. like to have played this game but for some reason they only released it in Malaysia like I don't know what their gaming community is there but when I when I picture like I don't I don't Malaysia doesn't seem or Malaysia Southeast Asia besides maybe South Korea and their Starcraft scene they don't really seem that big in the game you, know, you don't really hear about famous Malaysian gamers or games set in Malaysia or even a film scene, or I don't know. I don't know enough about Malaysia to tell. Maybe they do. If I'm wrong, oh, right on. Maybe it was the best decision for the country. But I just feel like if they even try to release a beta in like a closed beta, even a, a green light, like what I did with War Rights, where I paid money to, to support the company in the states or Canada, fucking, I totally would have, and I'm sure a lot of other guys would have too. I've, I've, been, I've tried to read forums and posts and stuff about updates on the game but that's the other thing too like whoever's running this joint they have no idea how to market and or up like give us news like they're not giving us any breadcrumbs to follow they basically just said games somewhat in production and then it just disappears forums are just covered with like spam and bots and there's no like new screenshots and such it's all just you know the same few trailers from like 2014, 2011, 2006, which is one of the most badass E3 trailers, by the way. Angry Joe did a huge uh, segment on it at an E3 once, and got it got his like top game of the E3 that year, I forget which year it is, but it was good to see that, see, he's a big fan, and he has an army of fucking supporters, I'm sure, somewhere, I just see an officer, holy shit, I'm sure somewhere out there, if they had a tried, you know, I don't know how much it costs to... The game was translated too at one point. I played a Malaysian, because Malaysia has a lot of English speaking people there. I played the Malaysian beta when it was English, and I played the Chinese beta when it was in Chinese. Or Mandarin, sorry. You're the only blood sucker here. How about I report that you died in battle? Go ahead. Try it. Why did you come to my troop? I came to find the Dragon Tomb, as Lord Valdemar ordered. Common enough for my kind to oversee yours. Is it also common for a half-leech overseer to be assigned to a single troop? Those archers are near, so we don't have time for this. So either try me, you stupid tree hugger, or step off. Next time. I'll ignore this incident, you coward. I won't, you bitch. Don't run. Infantry can block arrows when walking or standing. The blood button issues the defensive formation. This decreases speed, but increases defense. The white button is used for the open formation. Not understood, bud. What should we do? Okay, well, that killed one of my guys. Wow. He probably literally killed the person. Jeez. Wow, they are level 7. Look at that. Jesus Christ. That's why. I'm fucking level... I have one, probably one stat, two stats in melee and one in... A, oh no, I probably have one in fire, one in scout, and one in melee. As a default. 
have hurt. There was a squad leader. I don't know where he went though. There he is. He looks exactly the same as the rest of them, which kind of sucks. Doesn't even have shield or anything. Come on, come on. And if you're trying to... Sorry for talking over the dialogue there, but I, I can probably guarantee you it wasn't that riveting shit. Oh shit, no, they're still fighting. <laughs> So I've been trying to sing its praises for years, I've been giving it the benefit of the doubt, I've been playing their eight foreign betas, but it looks like Kingdom of Fire 2 is officially gone. As of March 20th, I think they said they're going to shut down all the servers and continue on other projects, the company says. Like, Jesus Christ, like, there are other projects, like 99 Nights has been successful. Jesus Christ, if you ever play that game, it's fucking bad. It's basically a really poor imitation of this in Dynasty Warriors, but with, like, no soul behind it. Fun, mindless action slashing fun, if that's what you're into. All I want to do is just get a, a good, functioning, modern action RPG RTS hybrid with fantasy elements, like orcs and humans, like a Lord of the Rings type game with these mechanics. That would be fucking perfect for me. I think Mountain Blade is the only game that has a hope left. That Conqueror's Blade beta I've been trying there is okay, but it's mostly uh, multiplayer versus each other, and it's, it's hard it's, it's hard to get into it. Because it's, uh, it's a free-to-play too, so it's obviously like guys who spent money on loot boxes and stuff are obviously going to do much better. Let's kill these new level 10 knights, eh? It's actually pretty intimidating fighting armored knights. Like on the other side. Oh, sorry, I must not fire, I must have lightning instead. That's alright. If I can get myself a lightning sword from the shop in my next uh, level up, good shape, boys. Doesn't seem like I'm making all that much progress. I think in the instruction manual for this, it says the tree of healing also poisons enemies, but I don't believe that happens. Or if it does, it is, the, the damage is so minute that it's barely even noticeable. Or at least they said that with uh, Curatio. Like, if you're playing as like the Dark Legion now and the humans would be casting Curatio on the either from themselves, it would say one of the one of the officers would say like instead of they casting meteor they would say our men are poisoned by blood by curatio and, I don't, and even if you don't have ghouls which another thing ghouls are not the best unit to have and uh, when you're the player enemy ghouls sure they're tough to beat fine enough they can be okay if you use them but honestly using melee units at all besides your main officers or your main commanders group. Is not that effective. You're way better off having a cavalry as, a, as your secondary melee or another range. Like three arch, one Lucretia and three archers is infinitely better than two melee and an archer and a, a cavalry. So. I wouldn't even expect two cavalry to be all that effective. Oh my god, these knights are fucking exhausting to fight. Alright, let's get in there. Finish those archers off. Kill them quickly. Go, cavalry, move. I'm surprised cavalry didn't do more damage to these archers. Cavalry's not 
they're just good at hanging up enemy units in melee. They're awful, actually, at killing said units. Whereas in the second, the sequel, cavalry are awful at charging units, and they're actually semi-okay at uh, fighting in melee. Probably another reason why it didn't do too well, because that's the whole MMO aspect. It's just, it doesn't have as much uh, depth, besides the fact that they have lots of units and MMO features. All right. Crafting and abilities and skill trees and shit. Crap. Ass experience. I forgot how slow these campaigns progress, experience-wise. You were awesome, Rithri. Well, I hardly did anything. That's true. Let's get back to all this. Uh -huh. Isn't the uh, let's be pals. You can call me Maureen, Lucy. It's Lucretia, bitch. Fuck! I want a, a dollar for every time they call each other bitches in this game. Arayan, it's been so long. My old hometown. It's my first time here, but the castle looks human-made. It was. Now it's our. Good work, Lucretia. You bought us some time. Are we going to stay here till Renier comes? For now, yes. All we need to do is make sure he comes quickly. Rest your troops while you can. Lucretia, if you wish to re-equip your troops or change their job, I recommend you to visit the barrack. Okay, so I think... Uh, to make them Dark Knights, you need seven melee. Okay, so how much experience do I have to work with here? I don't really want to... I don't trust her. What? Who? Ruman, you go. Her loyalty to the bloodsuckers bugs me. Why does she support them like that? Well, you think the Cadence are any better? Are you nuts? What if someone here? Look, you brought it up. You're such an idiot. Even if one Cadence High Elf is found, the entire troop is beheaded. So shut your mouth. Hey, Rithi, what are the Cadence? The High Elf rebels looking to make Velen the High Elf nation. They're opposed to the regime. And it's impossible as long as Renier stand. Who is he? Is he pretty? Pay attention. It's because of Renier that Waldemar gained power to rule Veland and Dark Elves. Renier conquered Hexter and brought the pigs and ogres under Waldemar's rule, so we Dark Elves were conquered as well. Mm, actually, Renier is neutral. He doesn't much care for Waldemar's rule. What? Renier just wanted Hexter. He has no desire to help Waldemar. How would you know? Lucretia. Commander Ruman calls to the main castle. Oh, ah. Uh, it's the Oversucker. I mean, Seer, of course. Maybe you should just call me Maureen. Lucy. Whatever pleases you, bitch. There's another one. There's another one. Oh, okay. So let's see what we got here. Oh my god, I can do the whole fucking kit and caboodle, eh? Alright. Kelza Hall. So I want to get rid of... I don't want to level up Rithrin at all because he's, he's full, full of shit and he's going to leave me soon. They're probably good at that level. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to level her up to 7. Change to Dark Elf Knights. Then I'm going to... Commander Room. What? I was just there! Oh, that sucks. Lucretia, you know the Glaucus River? Fuck. Of course. Do you know of the riverbank upstream? Yes. This is where Renier will cross, so we need to guard the floodgate. Hello? A bit paranoid? You really think those apes will come that far? In war, I prepare for the worst. I guess that's why it always happens. I've ordered orc sappers to set traps near the riverbank and deploy guards. Go there in a day or two and scope things out. If the hog mission is already underway, why do I need to babysit them? Have you ever seen hogs do anything right the first time? Ever? Now see to it! What did you do in the war? I babysat pigs, that's what. This sucks. What? We got to go to Glaucus River. We have to watch the pigs watch the riverbank. Oh, great. Why the Glaucus? Renier's coming that way, so we need to keep the chimps at bay if they think to go there. Come on, if humans were that smart, Velen would have fallen long ago. They're smarter than you think. They would have to be. We leave at Moonfall, two days from now. Company, move out. 
Okay, good. So let me just should do a quick save here. Let's see what uh, if I'm forced to bring anybody here. Yes, I am. Fuck. Okay. It pains me to do this, but I'm gonna have to give him some. Let's just get him to ten. Really pains me to waste experience on that traitorous cur. This view is lovely. Yeah, like a picnic in the park. Picnic my ass. There's the Glaucus River. Renier will cross somewhere around here. Our hogs are guarding the river bank, and traps are set around the area. So, babysitting is the name of the game. We're here to make sure these mindless hogs don't mess it up. Maybe you'd like to take their place, Lucretia. Shut up, Hatch. This is my briefing. Get out there and watch the hogs wallow. That is all. So this is a parallel, a mirror, if you will, of the mission on uh, Gerald, where I had to disarm the traps and open the floodgate. Honestly. If the hogs are guarding the riverbank, and there are traps around, why do we need to be here? I thought you bellies didn't trust orcs. So yes, I've upgraded to Dark Dark Elf Knights, who are... The only thing they have changed are they have shoulder pads. And a white tunic. Crotch cover thingy. Stupid. The humans must know of this place. Oh, please. They're gonna attack Renier this far upriver? They're apes. It's bad to fight with the sun in your eyes. You go to death. Troops, ready yourselves. Level one heavy infantry. I didn't think that was possible. You had a few sun in your eyes missions too. Oh. I can't remember if I actually get sappers in this. I think I do. Shit, this archer squad might be a bit of a problem for me since I'm facing the sun. Oh, Axemen. Idiots. They're our forces. Assist them, you pathetic elves. Right. Can't tell if these guys have leader either. Oh, looks like those archers are going to get engaged too. Archers are really fun to fight though because they have no shields, so they barely block any of your moves. They kind of just take it like champs. So that they are arch whores. I'm way higher than these guys. I'm not worried.
I get Axemen this one, so... That's the pickle I'm in, you see. You see, Axemen are pretty worthless. You can change them right into Cavalry, and, they, and you can change them back into Axemen if you want. But I guess I'll keep them Cavalry. Uh, I'll keep them Axemen for now. Yeah, I mean, I already have Dark Elf Cavalry. I might as well keep those already level 11, too. So, I'll, yeah, I'll keep them. I won't bother making Orcs. Doing pretty good against Hugh and Melee, though. Look at these guys' element. Fire. Okay, so I'm gonna change that. Well, no, it's Rithrin, yeah. The next arches I'll get, I'll put them lightning. Oh, yes, I can attack Hugh. Hugh! Get them, get them, get them, get them. Phew, that was close. There we go. This a big scruff. Frame drops, yo. That'd be a good 150 guys on the screen and a tree healing archers. This is what well, this is what I want. Give me more of this AAA gaming industry. Mountain Blade 2, you are my last hope. Those are great games, but they're a bit too simulator-like. They're a bit slow, campaign-wise. I usually use cheats just because fuck man, it takes forever to make money and get anywhere in that game. I know you have to commit, but whatever, man. I don't have time to commit like that these days. Being an adult is fucking stupid. And that game, it doesn't have, like, squads. You, you command your individual guys and can get kind of harrowing. I think we push them back. Get the Axemen to join us. All right, where's the obligatory enemy cavalry come and I have to show off how to use Axemen? Lucretia, you now control three troops. Quite a commander you've become. Yeah? If moving the troops one by one is too bothersome, press Y to command all troops to move. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for the point. Let's get to the riverbank to see if more monkeys are Monkeys. Oh, went the wrong way. All right. Let's go. The Dark Elves heal in trees, though, so it's pretty nice. So I don't... If they're minorly wounded, I can just run through the trees in about 10 seconds or so. They're good to go. Those are like metal thongs, too. Those cannot be comfortable. Thongs in general mustn't be that comfortable. I know girls wear them to impress the guys, but are they that are they comfortable to wear? I have no idea. I know getting wedgies is not fun. Especially after a long sweaty day. The riverbank looks secure enough. But we have to tell the main force about this. Who to send though? How about the little piggy? Sue it? Hey, look! It's the old human! Why can't they just die? Finish him! He's trying to bait us, but he's so slow! I'm glad they figured out that he's trying to bait them, because he's got the subtlety of a fucking ox. Ah! There's the obligatory cavalry. Oh, I don't even have to use them. Wow, they're gonna cut. There's probably gonna be another squad or two, but I'm gonna have to just wait through. Dead. 
the right trigger to view the map, Lucy. Identify the enemy's location. Archers are still pretty good against cavalry. Faster and safer that way. Oh, yes, guys, guys, guys. I did level them up to level three, so they're the fastest they can be. I know what's gonna happen, though. Spoiler alert, the water's gonna come. Shouldn't do too much to me. forgot that uh, he's still baiting us. Should be traps on the north side of the river. How? Stay calm. Fight. Forget the damn pigs. Oh, they took away my axe. What the fuck? Capture the riverbank and his sappers removed the traps. Hey, this the apes. You see what now? You're so dead. Rithrin, you said that old one is Gerald's superior. Lucretia, attack him first. What good would that be? Is Gerald being a Fuck, he gets stuck on the doodads. If we take the old one, Jerry. That's Warcraft 3 custom map. Chet and jargon there. No, I know who knows. They will be him. They will come to me. Okay, we'll try it. Soldiers, get that old monkey. Extra rations for the one who brings me his head. Let's go take out old Hugie. being on horseback they're easy to kill oh he's invulnerable now so that means Gerald's probably gonna turn up soon I imagine am I supposed to be looking for Gerald Confused. Retreat quickly. Have a chat. Nice work. Oh, there he is. If Joe whatever is here, guess her human side paid off. The sun's too bright. Archers can't aim well. This is gonna be neat. I actually, I can't remember fighting Gerald one on one. Oh, he's invulnerable too. Fuck me, come on. Ah, 
That's her exact dialogue from Gerald's mission either, but that'd be kind of neat if it was. Continuity. All right, let's bail, boys or girls. Oh. Mission accomplished. Is he gonna give me the experience of the orcs? No, what the fuck? It's like three squads of cavalry I killed. That's dirty. I'm wondering how Ruman knew the monkeys would be there. Why don't you ask her? She really likes you. She'd enjoy being questioned. Commander Ruman was awesome. I think that you were more awesome, Christian. Will you two teenagers knock it off? Let's go back to Orion. Maureen, do you think Lucy and Rithrin still, uh, you know, do I look like someone who would give an orc's ass? Shut up and move. Dunzo. All right, that'll do it for this part. Uh, I'll see you on the next one.